We are at the infamous counter and we're here to talk about VPX Zero Carb SR Zero. 100% whey protein isolate. Now, let me tell you a quick story about this. I actually went to the store, bought some protein from Vitamin Shop because I was the end of the year, beginning of the year, to give you credit for how, many, how much money you spent throughout the year. I bought one protein and found out it had another brand. It had a lot of mold in it. If you follow me on my vlogs, you know which protein it was. So I decided to go back. I read a lot about this back in the past. I've always wanted to try it. And by me and my coach has me on a very low, low carb diet. I decided to try this. Now I'm, I'm a big person that does not like vanilla because I don't think nobody does it right. A couple company does it right. Um, but when you invest in a protein that has zero pretty much everything, it's really watery. Uh, and it has a very hint of taste of what you're buying. So if it's vanilla, it's gonna have a very hint taste. So it's like vanilla water or vanilla tasting water. So. Let me give you my ideas on this. First of all, when I have, it's a very fine powder, like all of them, they're all light, pretty much. And when I put this in a shaker cup, it is it turns a very high yellow. Uh, I didn't like the coloration, but I know that's me getting to it. You look at the supplement facts, everything in the back of it is pretty much zero. I don't know if you can see that. Everything's pretty much zero. Um, it has, Zero, it has less than one gram of fat. It has zero carbs, zero sugars, 20 grams of protein. Okay, it's a GMP product. It's gluten free. So, would I recommend this product? As you know, I've done videos comparing Dimitaz and uh, ISO 100 as well as Nature's Best. Isopure. And if I had to choose between those three, this would not be one of them. Um, I don't know what to say about it. I mean, it's not bad. You know, it, it serves its purpose. And a lot of people are into fitness to the point it doesn't matter if it tastes bad. But I, for one, like a product that works, that tastes good, that you look forward to because you're already dealing with a diet situation or dealing with a certain, your macros are a certain way. So you want to have something that tastes good. Um, this is not the worst protein I've ever had. It's not bad, but once again, there are other alternatives. So would I recommend this? I would not. Um, but if you had to have something and this was on the last thing on the shelf, you can get it. But my view on this VPX Zero Carb SR Zero, oh, it's not a gimmick. It's not worth it. Just going out by. Get you some Dime Taz, get you some Nature's Best, um, you even got uh, Centrex got some stuff out that I'm going to be doing some more. So it's not bad, but it's not a must. Not go out and get me. So if you're one of those persons just itching to try it, um, you're going to be somewhat disappointed. But it does serve its purpose. All right, guys, that's it. That's my testimonial. I'll let you later. Peace out.